So we back with another reaction video, but today we got y'all boys with something a little different. RDC kind of has like this little podcast, but it's not really, it's like kind of different from all the other podcasts. These guys will go and sit with like eight guys and they'll just have their opinions on which one they choose and stuff like that. And it's really topic based. So they'll talk about movies. The next moment they'll talk about shows. The next moment they'll talk about fights. They'll talk about all different type of things and they'll be deciding which one has to go so yeah we're gonna be reacting to that today this is gonna be a little bit longer on the side of videos if you guys want more of these i can go ahead do that just show the support like subscribe all that good stuff comment down below and that's all i ask but yeah without further ado let's hop straight into it let's go! Another episode of for this episode is pretty spicy. It's, it's, <laughs> it's one gotta go or one gotta do something because some people might have a little, <laughs> a little wild extra, wild yes, a little extra yeah. stuff. Yeah. It's gonna be a good one, just like the last one. This or that. This is one gotta go. Yeah, yeah. Expect some nonsense from this lot of people. <laughs> <laughs> a wild lot. Before we get in this. We have a podcast. In the title, it's already some wild people stuff been going saying, on. Where's the podcast? The podcast is on all Apple Podcasts, Spotify, uh, Pandora, uh, Amazon. Didn't know they had a what podcast. Search up? To be honest. search up back and forth. In with the in. Or just type, no, type in RDC World. It's going to come up. Oh, RDC man. World. That's, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's that was weirdly RDC said. RDC World. Just, and yes, it has yes, all sir. the old back and forth. So there. Damn, so don't got a five star love. rating. And, uh, Every uh, single time somebody rated them, they had like 300 ratings. Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Fruity Pebbles, Captain Crunch, or Reese's Puffs. Right, I'm going to be honest. If anything, we're going to do this the opposite way. Because me personally, I'm not really crazy on cereal. But if we doing one got to go, we're going to say one got to stay. Because none of these other shits even matter to me. Give me Captain Crunch and I'm cool, bro. I'm going to be honest. And it don't matter if we talking about berries only, the no berries, which is like really like the only competition for these other three. But, like, there's so many different flavors you could go with, bro. Captain Crunch Berries is not close. Never mess with Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Never mess with Fruity Pebbles. Never mess with Reese's Puffs. Only thing I messed with in comparison to Captain Crunch was the commercials. The Reese's Puff commercials, not close. Fruity Pebbles commercials, not close. Cinnamon Toast Crunch commercials, not close. Captain Crunch commercials was nowhere near the other three. But if we really want to make this something crazy, go ahead, throw on the, uh, the Fruit Loops. The uh, Frosted Flakes, and um, what's the dude with the L Lucky Charms? Then we got a conversation in. But these four, nah. Nah, you're not getting me with these four. I'm going to be honest. You're not okay. getting me with these four. That's easy, right, guys? Yeah, finna hug. You're not getting me with these four. But y'all, I knew y'all was going to take two out of there, bro. I put Captain Crunch. I put Captain Crunch, too, bro. Reese's Fuck Puffs, no. bro. Reese's Puffs, that whole bus, bro. You what? trust me. You tripping, bro. Did this nigga say Captain Crunch? Have you, have you lost your mind? Have you lost your mind? Nah, see that John nigga. It's always something. With, it's always something with these niggas named John. Bro. It really is. It's facts. He get a strike. Did he get a strike? They do, but they peak is high. They do. They get soggy too. They do get soggy fast, but you gotta eat them quick. I'm gonna be honest. Fruity Pebbles is probably the worst one. You gotta be young to make that. It's either that or Reese's Puff for me. I can actually deal with Cinnamon Toast Crunch. I was done making that mistake when I was like 13. But that shit just extremely sweet. Like nigga, literally cinnamon. What was you getting? Reese's Puffs or Cinnamon Toast Crunch? Oh no, gentlemen, does he get a strike? I want him to get something. No, strike. What? You should get a strike for how sorry as shit is. Captain Crunch. Reese's Puffs. And, bro, I ain't gonna lie. Yeah. I can't imagine yeah. watching an yeah. RDC yeah. podcast because yeah. these yeah. niggas' yeah. facial yeah. reactions yeah. be yeah. hilarious. Yeah. Bro, come on, bro. Yeah. Especially yeah. Martin. Yeah. Nah, the commercials, like I said, bro. Reese's Puffs damn near like solo. Wait, didn't Reese's Puffs? What? Oh. What? Reese's Puff did sponsor us. I'm going to have to go with... <laughs> oh, yeah. I just remember. I'm going to have to go Crunch. with Captain Crunch. Crunch. Right. Yeah, yeah Captain Crunch. Crunch. There it is. And that was a close one, too. Yeah. I only chose Captain Crunch because... Wait, did this oh, nigga change it to Captain Crunch? Hold on. What is going on? What is this propaganda? Nigga, if y'all don't keep y'all... Y'all don't keep y'all pole, y'all don't keep y'all whiteboard. 
What in the world? Really just, I tried to balance out the four. I was all right. I already got Fruity Pebbles, so I don't need. I, I want a chocolate cereal, I guess. So I chose. That's why I was like, all right. Man. That whole just bust. The, what you need? Before we had that last I time, I would have chosen. No, I just no, said Cocoa Puffs. No, Reese's Puffs. Cocoa Puffs Puff. 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 trash. Yeah, Cocoa like, Puffs, sorry. Oh, chocolate. Ice would be hot. hot. Yeah, co Cocoa Pebbles. Oh, right. I, 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 I didn't get those like that. Cocoa Pebbles. Oh, okay. Because I thought that was bad. Like a ripoff. I like the whole tuna. I like the whole tuna. That was like the milk chocolate. Sorry, bro. I know it's getting caught me off guard because I was like, no, I was making fun of you. So I, 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 I like to switch back around. I'm like, the hell said does not compute. <laughs> it's a real one for real. Toy Story, The Incredibles, Lion King, okay. or Finding Nemo. Right. No, no, no. Let's, let's, let's go back. 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 The hell said does let's not go back. Because this is what I really came for. I'm going to be honest. I've seen this in the title. I'm not even going to waste your time. I'm not even going to cap to y'all. I've seen this in the title. I didn't see all four, but I've seen this in the title. Toy Story, Incredibles, Lion King, Finding Nemo. Now, I was having a conversation with somebody the other day. I was telling them, animation-wise, what are you talking about? Animate anything. Toy Story, damn near best animated things ever. Like, not really no comp for it. I'm going to be honest. That one has no comp out of these four. No comp whatsoever. Then, we got to go Lion King. Lion King is just too iconic, bro. I mess with Incredibles. I mess with Finding Nemo. I mess with all of them. But Lion King is just a little bit too iconic from the songs, the trilogy. Like, I don't know what to tell you. If I had to go with the second place, it would be Lion King. Then when it comes to Incredibles and Finding Nemo, that one's, that's extremely tough. I'm going to be honest. Because I probably have actually watched Finding Nemo more than Incredibles. I'm going to be honest. But I probably... Whew, I ain't gonna lie though. If I never had Incredibles, I still would have all these other superhero movies. Mmm. And it's a lot of deep stuff going on in Finding Nemo. So, um, uh, man, I don't know. I don't know. I probably do like Incredibles more. But if I never had Finding Nemo, or if I never had find, or the Incredibles, I probably would rather Finding Nemo. So I might have to say Incredibles gotta go. That's kind of tough. Nah, I ain't gonna lie. Them last two kind of tough. Finding Nemo. Damn, damn. That's a... That's tough. All right, last one kind of tough. Back up, back up. All right, y'all stop playing. It's not that. It's, it's, not, that that tough. Tough. it's not that tough. It wasn't that tough. It's not that tough. It wasn't that tough. Man. Okay. It's, it's not that tough to me. Either. It's not that tough. It's not that tough. Yeah. These are four classic <laughs> movies <laughs> that you can... Bro, you know it's a classic <laughs> kid <laughs> movie if you can watch <laughs> it when you're... Go. It's a classic. All right, yeah. yeah I'll do it. Oh, oh, oh. Lion King, nigga, are you okay? Did this nigga say Lion King? Bro, what? How is that even possible, bro? Uh, but Lion King, I do not fuck with Lion King that much no more. I fuck with Finding Nemo yeah, no right now in my life. Yeah, right, right now, right like now. Same. Okay. But, so, but back then, I thought it was back then. I understand. Well, I watch. I watch. Oh. 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 You know why did you choose? Why did you choose Lion King? <laughs> I like all the other three more. <laughs> why? Cause I. You said why? Had, Finding Nemo get a live you know, action right now. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. No, 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 wait, wait. That get a live action. That not gonna do. What are these reasons? I ain't know we was even talking about the live action. Bitch, Snoopy, nigga, what the no, fuck we gonna do? I don't wanna watch that, bro. Oh, Free Willy? Oh, that was what the fuck? That was a bullet map. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna be honest. Akuna Matata, though? You just gonna fuck it up. Hey, look, look. I'm gonna be real with you. I thought about the songs, and I was like, fuck, let's go. Yeah, you're tripping, bro. When you gotta go, that means the songs are going forever. You're tripping. You're tripping hard, bro. It's gonna break it down. Nigga, I know! I know! I know! Movie, but I love all these movies a lot. Incredibles is number one, though. No, no, that, that's not Incredibles one. Incredible. What the hell are we talking, bro? Toys, bro. Toy. This, they, these three movies. I'm gonna be honest. These three movies is Toy Story, and then there's a gap. Then there's Lion King. Then there's a gap. And the gap between Lion King and the, the other two way smaller than the gap between Toy Story and the rest for me. I'm gonna be honest. It's not really even. 
Really a debatable thing for me, I'll be honest. Toy Story 1, Toy Story 2, Toy Story 3, Toy Story 4, all classics. Classics. Like, not even joking, bro. Toy Story 3, damn near better than every other movie between these other ones. Like, 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 Finding Nemo 1, Finding Nemo 2, Incredibles 1, Incredibles 2, Like, in 1, 2, 3. I don't care about all them damn songs. Toy Story 3, damn near the best animation film ever. I have to pick between Incredibles and Lion King, I'm picking Incredibles. Oh, I am too. It's tough. That's my That's favorite picture. Like, like, right, like right now, if I had to choose between Lion King and Incredibles, I would choose Incredibles. Now. Like 100%, right? Right now. But, uh, I was like, going off right now. Then what are you saying? But no, it, but, no but in life, if I had to delete one from all of my existence, I probably wouldn't. I think I have to have Lion King. Yeah, if you got to, bro, bro delete like, one from, sure. from your whole what existence is crazy. It ain't gonna lie. That nigga's no. tripping. There's no way you're picking Incredibles over Lion King to watch right now. What are you talking about? I'm gonna be honest. Listen, Nala? No, you're Lion King you're definitely you're should you're not you're be you're out of here. I understand. Story 2. Story 2. The story is, is great. <laughs> story, story 4 was <laughs> not as good as the first three, but I wouldn't go as far as ass. I wouldn't go as far as ass. I wouldn't go that far. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, Toy Story. But I might have gassed it a little bit. I might have gassed it a little bit. Yeah, that's possible. Y'all are trying to say that Lion King is... But you can't tell me Toy Story 3 not crazy. You can't tell me that. It's the same It's literally the number one Pixar movie, bro. I'm yeah, saying. It's my shit. Incredibles is my shit. It's the same tier. Ain't gonna lie though, if you wanna mix it up and make it a little harder, take out Toy Story, take out Lion King, but replace that with Up. I don't know what else you would replace that with. What's another like classic, like a classic, classic kids movie? Dang, I can't even think of nothing, bro. Cars, maybe? Maybe Cars, Finding Nemo, Up. In the other two, uh, I might be. I feel like I feel like that's tough right there, bro. I bet Lion King leaving. <gasps> okay, I'll, 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 yes. that's fine. That's fine. I'm saying. It's not what you like right now. It's one has to go. I liked The Incredibles more than Lion King right when The Incredibles came I'm out. I'm arguing Lion King. I feel like Incredibles more over time. I got a time I like Lion King. Off first watch, too. Too. first watch, I'm Incredibles, bro. This shit, this shit. I said this shit incredible. You feel me? There's no way you're saying. Alright, oh, alright. He did. Incredible's dead. Incredible they gotta get out because of that shit. Oh, y'all hold me. Hold the whole that shit topic. Was incredible. That was incredible. That's an incredible pun. Out of these Marvel movies. Oh, oh shit. Brother. Fuck. Winter Soldier, Civil War, He's John, niggas. Infinity War, or Black Panther. Y'all hold the fuck out of me. What the fuck just happened? What the fuck? This shit incredible. I had to hear that shit again. <laughs> Alright. Uh, hey, uh, 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 oh, y'all hold me. Hold the whole that topic. Incredible. That was a credible pun. Out of these Marvel movies. Oh, oh shit. Brother. Fuck. Winter Soldier. Okay. Civil okay. War. Infinity okay. War. What Black the Panther. fuck? Bro, what? I didn't even hear this at first. I didn't even hear this at first. I didn't even hear this at first. Like this is this is actually sick work. Like I'm gonna be honest, bro. I'm gonna be honest, bro. There's a lot of stuff I wanna say, but I'm gonna hold it back. I'm gonna hold it back. Cause you some brothers. So I ain't even gonna say that. But putting Black Panther on here is sick work. I'm gonna be honest. Now, if you would have just did the other three without Black Panther, maybe you throw in like a Thor Ragnarok or something, like a No Way Home by Spider Man, then we got a little conversation. But I'm gonna be honest. If I'm saying Infinity War, Civil War, or Winter Soldier, Civil War gotta go. For me. But if we're doing these four, it's not close. Get Black Panther going. Bye. Bye, Black Panther. Hey, who did that? Who, who did that? Me. Y'all hold the, that? Hell, the hell out of Black Panther. You trying to get us canceled? One, <laughs> one, one got to go screenshot all the Black Panthers. There'll be no context. <laughs> you put me all with you. You know what? Um, bro, yeah, you, that's, I hold. Damn, I hold. I hold. You hold for yeah, real, bro. bro. You can't put all them feature movies versus just Black oh, Panther yeah, by himself. It's his first movie. Hey, bro, you racist. <laughs> bro. What was the feature movie for Winter Soldier? <laughs> for failure, no cap. <laughs> That was just when that was just Captain America being a goat. <laughs> that's, well, that racism is not funny. Man. All right, Ant, Ant Man, Spider Man Homecoming, Guardians of the Galaxy. Okay. All right. Now we talking. All right, Doctor Strange, Guardians of the Galaxy. 
I'll be honest, that's not like I don't know why these two are on here with these other two. But I'm gonna be real with you. And we just doing the movies and not the collection. Cause I know niggas gonna really push hard for Spider Man because of the collection. Cause yeah, we ended up getting no way home. But if we talking about Ant Man versus Spider Man Homecoming, keep it a bean. Ant Man, one of the funniest Marvel movies. It's not like like no joke, not trolling. Like you get like keep it a bean. Ant Man, I know Marvel like to do that funny shit, bro. But Ant Man actually is a funny movie. Sometimes it can get a little overbearing with the funniness in the Marvel stuff, bro. But Ant Man is actually funny. Homecoming is actually one of the worst Marvel MCU vi movies. I don't care what nobody says. It's like it literally is. So I would say Homecoming. But if you're, I know people are gonna try to do that cap and try to say, what about the second movie? What about the third movie? I think the second movie is better. I think the third movie is by far the best of the three. So if you're saying you don't get this, you don't get the other two, then we kind of cheat. Then we kind of cheat. Then you can say, what about Ant-Man? You don't get Endgame and Infinity War. So then they could cheat with that. So I'd probably say Homecoming, personally. That's what I would say. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me tell you, let me tell you, let me tell you. Let me tell you. Let me Homecoming isn't Hello. bad. It's just Homecoming? in comparison to like the Amen. other Marvel movies, I would say Spider-Man. Wow. Let me see who's Who's one got to go? Dude? Thank you, bro. Who's one got to go? Spider-Man, you're know. ruining the beginning of the start of the nigga Tom Holland. Just what else? They yeah, could just do something else, though, nigga. Like, no, bro, we're not doing that. We're not doing that. They would just do something else, bro. They did it with one of the worst Spider-Man villains, too, bro. Like, was the, uh, we can live without the Ant-Man series, but it's a good movie. Yeah, it's a good It's a good. It's a good movie. It's fun, it's fun to watch. Uh, we can live without it. I'm all right. Ant-Man is a better movie than Homecoming. But Homecoming is just a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a trilogy. intro to Spider-Man. Spider I probably would say if I had to do an order on that, I'd probably go Guardians of the Galaxy. No, Doctor Strange, Guardians of the Galaxy, Ant-Man, then Spider-Man. I think Guardians of the Galaxy is close to Doctor Strange, but Doctor Strange probably like up there with my top three, five Marvel movies. I really like Doctor Strange, the original. I haven't seen the new Doctor Strange, actually. That's the crazy part. PS2. Oh yeah, oh yeah, we getting we getting wicked. Oh now we getting real, we getting nasty. We getting real, real wicked right here. Okay, I like how they didn't really try to put it to where like they was competing. They didn't try to put like PS4 versus Xbox One. I like how these are all different generations of games, so you can't really do that. Now I know what they're gonna try to do. They're gonna try to cap and be like, what if if these games never came out on this, you would never get those games on those other games. That's a crazy, that's, if you're doing that, then obviously you got to go with the, the first. But if we just talking about generations, what was the most fun? Whoo, that's a tough one. I would go 360 is the best one. Then I'll go PS2. I was really not much of a GameCube Nintendo person, though. So I kind of feel like that's a cop-out. But if we're doing against those two against each other, we really got to base it off what's the best Pokemons, what's the best Smash Bros, what's the best Mario games from those generations. Hoo-wee. Hoo-wee. See, now, if they would have put the Wii on here, that would have been tough. Because the Wii got some... Hoo-wee hoo -wee got some shit. But GameCube and Nintendo... Hoo-wee. I probably have to say Nintendo 64. I probably have to say Nintendo 64. Nintendo 64. So, so the choice is a six, 64 GameCube because <laughs> <laughs> no way, no way 360. Yeah, no way somebody picked 360. But I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm, a, let's just go. All right, All right we'll just see. Ready? Yeah. Turn this all around. I picked PS2, man. I ain't gonna lie, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not mad at somebody saying PS2, but I'm gonna be honest with you. Xbox 360 changed gaming. Like, I don't care what nobody says, Xbox 360 literally changed gaming. Whether you want to talk about the games it had, how indie games worked on there, but just off party chat alone, Xbox 360 is one. I don't care what you say. Like, you can say a lot of different things, but I don't care what you say. The party chat for Xbox 360 literally changed gaming. It's not really close. Sorry. I have. What's PS going on? PS2. I have PS2. Oh, wait, six, see, that's a cop out. See, when you don't have a PS2, that's a cop out. See, I had. See, I was a PlayStation person. Then when 360 came out, had to get the 360. 360 was just too nice. So I was a PlayStation. I had PlayStation One. I had a uh, Game Boy. 
Whatever that joint was called. PlayStation 2. Now went 360. They didn't have a PlayStation 3. They didn't have a PlayStation 4. What? Okay, I didn't have a 360. See? See? Oh, I, thought I, yeah, I have that. faith in these I lame. <laughs> I had no They didn't have Xbox. Y'all didn't have Xbox. Yeah, I know. So it's just like. I didn't own one. So was, uh, uh, yeah. See, that's the cop out. And you didn't have PS2. I have PS2. Uh, yeah, it's so. tough. It feels X. Uh, I, I like. I had 64. was crazy. Yeah, 64 was a lot of games on that. That's a lot of games on that. You doing you do what I just did with Lion King. You know what I mean? I took it back. I said, hold on. That's tough because 64 had hits. Oh, it, it is. Hits. Golden hits. Guy, uh, Mario Kart, Mario Kart, Mario 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 but, 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 yeah, but GameCube had the PS. The PS2. GameCube. Yeah, GameCube. All right, give me your hits on GameCube. Melee. I yeah. mean, really, that's uh, an argument uh, between uh, Sonic Adventure Battle 2, Sonic Adventure Battle 2, Mario Sunshine. I don't know none of these games. Let me be honest. Uh, PlayStation 2 games, is, like PlayStation 2 games and Xbox 360 uh, games, kind of uh, tough. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go out compare them <laughs> games to those <laughs> games you was getting on PlayStation 2 and Xbox 360. Bro, 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 bro. Yes. Bros on Wii. Yeah, I forgot, I forgot. Because right, I'm gonna be honest Star with you. Smash, bro. I know a lot of you niggas thinking they're exclusives, but let me go ahead and say a couple games. Probably the greatest 2K of all time, 2K11. Probably the best CODs of all time. Modern Warfare 2, uh, Modern Warfare 3, Black Ops 1. Black Ops 2, all on the uh, 360. That's just COD. Then you want to talk about Battlefield, Battlefield 3. That's just Battlefield. Then you got Castlevania Z, Minecraft, uh, GTA 5, GTA 4. Like, bro, there's so many different games on the 360, bro. And these are not, like, just exclusives either, bro. Like, I'm just being, I'm just saying, bro. 360's kind of tough, bro. Oh, like the, the era like, of games that's coming out on 360 is kind of tough uh, to beat, bro. Man, These are classic games. Was the best game classic ever created at that point. It was 007, Super Smash Bros. Regular, uh, 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 Majora's Mask, and um, Ocarina, Ocarina of Tom. Oh really my gosh, I forgot I Halo 2, Halo 3. Oh my gosh, Halo 3, Halo Reach. Oh my goodness, you, you, bro, you're, you're dead, bro. Nah, I'm not gonna be honest. With you. The mother's on GameCube, so I'm all right with it. Man, no, they're, the no, they're gone. They're gone. Yeah. If they're not on, if they're not on uh, Nintendo 64, they don't make it to GameCube. I think 75% of those games, Halo, game, Halo, Legendary games. Yeah. Halo was yeah. never bad. Seven, PlayStation had them, but, like, but like, I'm not saying PlayStation didn't have them. I'm not saying they're exclusives. I'm saying those were Xbox 360 era games. That is that era of games. That's not fair. What? Why would That's they that have era of game. Yeah, yeah. Why, if, if you did that, why would exactly. we ever thought of it? Yeah, the game is not always better though. It was, it no, it's not. Yeah, it's, it's not. not it's not. I'm saying this case is like 75. Back then, wait, 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 so I'm not saying like, PlayStation like, didn't have Super those games. I'm saying the era of 360 yeah, yeah, in yeah. PlayStation 3 yeah, but, is a better era for games than PS2. And I think PS2 was goaded too, but I just think the era was just better, bro. I'm just saying it was better. I'm just all I'm saying. The only thing that 360 Separated like from all these other I games as well, game. for sure. Besides the era of games, yeah, is party. How, I, it's I not never, really close. The party it, chat literally changed games. You. I don't Why care what nobody says. If, 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 they, if we're not ending all the lineages, the gears, bro. Like, like, come on, bro. There's so many different things. Even if you want to talk about exclusives, that's when the Xbox exclusives was in tip top shape, bro. No, it's Naruto. All of Naruto's leaving. That means a new system can't ever win. What do you mean? No, all the, all the, all the newer hits. systems got new games. Elden Ring ain't on the old systems. Uh, Modern but, Warfare ain't on the old systems. But I'm saying, but if, if, it was no, if it was no Dark Souls, no, it, it wouldn't be all called. Call I'm call just call saying, bro. This is direct. Bro, I'm going to be honest, bro. If we take an Xbox 360 away, and the way what he's saying, we got to take away Black Ops 2, we got to take away Black Ops 1, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, COD 4, like, you're sick. If you're really saying you want to take that away, you're sick. I'm going to be honest. You're sick. You're sick. You're that, sick. That, that would be all Modern Warfare, though, right? And not You're sick. The reason why Kai gets so much yeah, hate but, now is because of how good those games yeah, was. Yeah. I, I, I never thought of if it, it that starts way. On that, it, but I'm saying, like, then we had a game like Castle Mind Z that was actually one of the most yeah, we the classic same, underrated games of all time. If you know, you know. You can't just why, why, yeah, that's, why would we? And that was an Xbox exclusive. It can be Xbox One. Some niggas like saying Dragon Ball. 360 can be Xbox One. I don't know it is. What? Borderlands 2? Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. No, it's not close. It's not close, bro. I'm sorry. It's not close. Comments, please. I'm sorry. It's not close. I ain't gonna argue on this one, y'all. Like, y'all can't even say, come on, Mark, you be bullshit. Like, what's the point of putting 64 if we just gonna. 
There's no bro, 64 <laughs> games is not fighting no fucking Xbox 360. It's games. a fact. fact. No, for sure. Why would we put 64? We should have put something else. We put in like we should have put like PS3. This nigga talking about. Yeah, this like, nigga said we had two K16 like on a PS2. <laughs> you playing, bro? You playing a PS2 in goddamn 2016? Goddamn it! Family Guy. How the fuck did you have two K16 on the PS2? Boondocks. Or robot chicken. All right. Now this one is crazy. Now this one is crazy. Family Guy, Rick and Morty, Boondocks, and Robot Chicken. I'm gonna be honest, bro. Only time I ever seen Robot Chicken, Family Guy is on. I don't swim. I didn't really like those shows ever. Hot take. But yeah, uh, Rick and Morty is a cool show. Uh, the last season was kind of a tough watch. So, obviously, we already know what the number one is. Boondocks. Like, it's not close. It's not close. So, second one probably had to be Rick and Morty for me. Third would have to be, bro, that, that, like, we're just, I'm, I'm going to just let them pick. Morty? Yeah, you no. son of a oh, bitch. That's crazy. crazy. I think Rick and Morty is an amazing ass show, but I think uh, Robot Chick, I used to watch that all the fucking time. Like, I, bro, I always thought Robot niggas, Chicken was it, weird it, as fuck, I'm, I'm sorry. What? Oh, that low key. That was hit. Robot Chicken, chicken has on. like, the, Robot Chicken has the least amount of hit episodes out of all these shows Facts. by far. Facts. So I don't know if you remember that whole, like, yeah. I, I, from what I, I remember. So that's actually Robot crazy because Boondocks only has like three seasons. I think Robot Chicken is air for a long time. Yeah, the way and, this whole is written, that was like a daily up, up like a happened, daily like new episode thing, kind of like South Park. Like used to, yeah, that. Family Guy used to be. Bro, Robot like Chicken got hits, but you don't. Yeah. I don't yeah. think you remember that whole yeah. like you thinking because yeah. that whole percentage don't got that one. Rick and Morty is definitely like yeah. one of the most unique shows I've ever watched. Rick and Morty is one of the most unique shows, but that don't make it good. It is a good show though. Good seasons. It's a lot of. But that's not like a. It's not like a. That whole thing for a long time. Creative as hell. I bet. I bet. Who got the big cancel? If you rewatch Robot about chicken right now you won't even laugh at him for sure. yeah, i just want you to know that because i've seen a lot of rick and morty cool recently. the first like, within the last two seasons two good for sure yeah, yeah. Like second season is better than the first one in my opinion bro. but then they kind of fell off more off the bit. nostalgia factor on that they one. nah yeah. boom, yeah. nah yeah. rick and morty nah. might have the wildest episode in tv history that episode where the niggas going around fucking dragons that might be the wildest shit i ever seen in my life Ever, nigga. And now, I, I was saying that shit was wild before I even knew that shit was trending. I didn't even know that was a trend, that that was, a, like, the worst episode in history. I thought that shit was hilarious. I ain't gonna lie. Because that shit is actually, like, some shit that you gotta be on some other shit to think of, bro. I'm gonna be honest with you. Like, you gotta be uh, bro, doing no, some no, serious no, shit no, no, to be no, thinking no, of that. Level us roll. Yeah. This nigga was going around <laughs> actually soundtracks. fucking dragons, bro. Bleach, Naruto, One Piece. Or Dragon Ball. Okay, soundtracks alone. Okay, I was gonna say, if we talking about the show, Dragon Ball gotta go. <laughs> Facts. But if we talking about soundtracks, Naruto one, uh, Bleach two, One Piece cool, Dragon Ball cool. I'm not. I don't even know which one on those. Cause like if you just do intros, One Piece pretty much has the same intro for every single episode. I'm trying to think, bro. Mm, they both like obviously they both got some legendary stuff because they're legendary shows. But like, which one would I say has to go soundtrack wise? Probably One Piece got to go off the fact because Dragon Ball got some like they actually have like some legendary stuff going on from when Goku goes super first went Super Saiyan. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, that probably has to be One Piece. It probably has to be. I'm guessing. It's but One Piece Dragon also has some crazy no, moments no, too, all right. bro. All, all, dra okay. all, all Dragon Ball. I don't know, but that's kind of tough. It's between those two. Remember, guys. I better not see no Naruto or Blue Stone. That's all I know. Go. They all say One Piece. So I'm not crazy. One Piece. I'm not crazy. Yeah. One Piece, it, bro. Dragon One Piece, <laughs> Dragon Ball, you out of control. <laughs> Look, One Piece, Bleach music is fucking. Nah, go to that's number one. Go crazy tier music. I would say Naruto's number two. Yeah. yeah. Top tier music. Dragon, Dragon Ball Z has really some good music. Man. Bruce Falconer, some Cold. great ass music. Cold. One Cold. Piece, amazing show. Obviously, my favorite. But OSTs. Oh, yeah. Fuck you, go to. John, you haven't seen it. Dragon Ball. <laughs> Dragon Ball could definitely just probably be. I don't even listen to One Piece. What? Well, that's oh, we're not Why? gonna take that answer. You don't like it. Well, what's your argument? I'm just saying, like, mm -hmm. don't do it, this. No. Bait, baited you. Everyone, <laughs> what's your what's your argument? No, for real, defend yourself. Bro, I don't know, bro, but I don't feel like Dragon Ball is. Y'all feel like One Piece got like good ass soundtracks? Oh, you on just watch Dragon Ball. One Piece. Yeah, I just watch Dragon Ball. Yeah. Oh, One Piece okay. has a, a good soundtrack. 
Yeah, none of these soundtracks are trash. Yeah, but one gotta go. But yeah. it's a this is a top tier soundtrack we talking about. One Piece actually has a really great soundtrack, but it's just not greater than Dragon Ball Z. Bleach and Naruto. Dragon Ball. Bleach. Should not even be here. That's how great it is, soundtrack wise. Them niggas out there fucking mixing that shit. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> studio, nigga, bro. That nigga was supposed to be a music studio, major. Bro. Hey, that nigga was supposed to be a music major for real. <laughs> I think he could pose the most himself. <laughs> My yeah. culture. Yeah. culture. He spent at least four oh. years of his life in Mexico. No cap. <laughs> oh, with the guitar? With the guitar. <laughs> that guitar <laughs> on uh, Bleach is hard. Well, I just feel like yeah. it doesn't. Like when I'm watching One Piece, like, I, I like this is very fitting. If it was shows, I'll probably go. I'm not saying. I'll probably go Naruto, One Piece. I really like the soundtrack that played when. Spoiler, but it's not that much. Of uh, I'm really only like two arcs from Bleach for real, but those two arcs are definitely top tier arcs. Like the Dragon the first time, that's a really good soundtrack. I probably go whole bro, but if you're talking about all of Dragon Ball, if you're talking about Dragon Ball, Dragon Ball Seeds, Dragon Ball Super is like one thing. I guess we're doing that because Naruto, Naruto Shippuden. soundtrack I think I've ever heard. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie to that. Bleach would be three days. But if we're talking about Dragon Ball Z alone, it'll probably be Dragon Ball Z two. Very clear. Before they come over, hey, a big fiction, bitch. <laughs> I watched the show too, bro. Like, y'all niggas, y'all, listen, anime fans can slow the fuck down. Slow y'all roll, bro. <laughs> niggas be out here acting like they on box over this shit, bro. Slow your roll. <laughs> hey, people, you bitch. <laughs> like, I, 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 I'm all for arguing to a height, like, where to where everybody, like, nigga, hell no, blah, 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 blah. But, like, nigga, y'all niggas be acting like niggas is literal, like, uh, like ops, like you gonna slide down the street on a nigga cause, cause of his favorite show or some shit. Like yeah, stop bro. it, bro. N- n- nobody built like that. That does not make me love anime any less. But it, let me tell you something. It gets on my nerves. Makes me not want to talk about anime as much cause niggas be on some bullshit. And don't you bring up no clips. Like, what was you doing? <laughs> I just said, <laughs> I just said, I will argue hard over shit, but I ain't, ain't nobody gonna be my op. Like I'm just gonna argue with passion, bro. Glad you said that. Yeah, definitely, hey, definitely shows, yeah, gonna do that. Hey, shows, yeah, that nigga Mark be arguing that motherfucker hard. You the main one. That's you. Nigga, I'll be playing, nigga. Like TMZ, man, cut that up. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. Itachi, Minato, Jiraiya, okay. Madara. I already know that this is gonna be wild. This one gonna be wild. I, when it comes to the Naruto characters, I say this all the time. I don't know how niggas be treating Naruto like this shit some some bullshit, bro. Naruto got the best characters, the best arcs, story. Like I don't even know. I don't know how niggas do this. But if we just talking about these four characters, one gotta go. Whoo, that's tough. Number one gotta be Jirai. We all know character development like crazy. Now, like, come on, bro. Like come on. Not Jirai gotta go. He gotta be number one. Who, hey, this one is tough. Now, this one is actually kind of tough. Now, this one is tougher than it seemed, bro. I'm going to be honest. Two, I'd probably say Itachi. I'd probably say Itachi, too. Because Itachi reveal is just on a different level. Itachi death reveal on another level. I don't know if his death is as crazy as Jiraiya death. But Itachi's death... But it's the, it's the Itachi and Jirai kind of OP because it's in the best arc all of anime. So I, 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 they're, they're one and two. Let me just say that. They're one and two. Then it's Minato and Madara. Huh, man, that's tough. I guess since we've seen Minato the least, it has to be Minato to go. Because Madara is a goaded villain. He's been hyped up the whole show. And he, like, even has, like, some... Hu- he even is humanized a little bit in the show. So we get to see, like, the reasonings behind he was doing a lot of stuff and stuff like that. And his rivalry with Hashirama and stuff like that. That's why I always said, instead of going the Boruto route, they probably should have went, like, the back-in-time route where we could have got a little bit deeper dive from, like, the first Hokage to the fourth Hokage. That would have been a cool little... You know, that's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. I would say me not to last. Fuck on the show. That's tough. It's on. Wait, so like it's on. Go. Yep, I knew he picked. Yeah, me not to gotta go. You see? How the hell did you pick Jiraiya? This nigga picked Jiraiya. How is that possible? How is that even possible? How is Jiraiya, how is Jiraiya going, bro? Yeah, I get he like a perv and stuff like that, but like. 
I don't know, bro. That's like, bro, from the from the scene where it's like he's showing his book off to Minato. I don't know, bro. It's obviously Minato. Minato's Minato, shown the bro. least. Well, well, like, we know the least about him. No, no, no. no. So he's if he like, left, it'll like whole, yeah, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah. But if Minato's said, said, gone, Naruto. Oh, my gosh. I ain't even think of that, bro. If Minato's gone, what about Naruto? Oh, that's kind of, nah. That, like, the whole show's going there. Like, what the fuck are we doing there? Like, what the hell are we doing? Like, nah, bro. That's actually crazy. I don't know. I don't know. Then maybe my bro didn't. Bro, if Madara goes, then like, oh my god, that's kind of crazy. Yeah. Oh damn. Now this was yeah, the best one. More like, like just their story goes away, but like, in and somebody else is reading their spot. Yeah, yeah, somebody else. Jiraiya, 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 Jiraiya. I guess I see what he's saying then, bro. Because if Jiraiya, bro, somebody else could have been uh, Naruto's. Uh, but he, oh, but no, Jiraiya's too perfect. That's what makes the pain arc so good. Jiraiya was the sensei for. It connect. Oh my gosh, that's a tough one. That's a tough one for real. That's actually a tough one. I see what he's saying. Minato was shown too little. So they're still in. No. Like, no, it's not Minato no more. It's just another nigga. Like somebody else gave birth to Naruto, but Minato was not the character. He is not the person anymore. He's just yeah. a racist. Yeah. His oh, some, somebody else did their job. Like yeah. Yeah. somebody else would have. Oh, up. somebody else do their yeah, job. Yeah. Then Madara gotta go. Because Obito literally could have just did that. Madara has to go then. It had to be Madara. That's the easiest person to go. Literally, that would be the easiest person to go because not only was Madara never ever even really beat, it's kind of bull how he lost. So that would like take that away. Like he was so broken that even Naruto and Sasuke, when it was just that broken, Mike God was that broken, they still couldn't beat him. Yeah, Madara would probably have to be the one to go, bro. Madara would have to be the one to go. At that point, oh, Madara would have to Oh, so it's not a one gotta go. Yeah, it is. Because yeah, the fight's all for them. Still, yeah, you got to pick which one. Who got, has to go? He clarified it before we wrote it. Yeah. The other, the other three, wasn't following. The other three gave us too many uh, story points, bro. Minato really didn't need to be there. For no, he just was the. To be completely honest, he had the smallest point of the story. The nigga is his fucking dad. Show? What do you mean the smallest point of the damn story? The nigga is his literal dad who sacrificed his life. Now, if you're saying somebody else could have been his dad, but he wouldn't even look... Bro, the nigga, the nigga Naruto would literally not even look the same. Now, I guess the Uzumaki part would still be there because his mom would still be there. So that there. But he literally wouldn't even have... Like, the signature yellow hair wouldn't even be there. That would be kind of weird, bro. Like, Naruto not having his dad would be weird. That would be weird. Like, that nigga not being his dad would be extremely weird, bro. Like, who the fuck else would they get to be Naruto's dad then? Like, I can understand the dry one, because you could have said, like, Kakashi could have been his sensei, could have just stayed a sensei. Um, the Itachi one, I don't know how they, they would do that one. That's probably, like, the hardest one to, like, just change, because that's, like, a pretty big part for Sasuke. So that's kind of, like... Like, oh, yes, no, he's I don't know Naruto's dad, but, like, Jiraiya, what he's done cannot be replaced. Madara, this is the a whole good story one. runs off of him. Itachi, Itachi makes the whole fucking yeah, Uchiha. Yeah, he makes the entire yeah, Uchiha storyline connected yeah, to, like, the... Only way I could have saw, like, no. maybe Jiraiya is my... Madara would have to be the one to go, bro. He's the, oh, he's the he's the easily, he's the easiest person to change. Somebody else could have literally played his role in history. But it really does go from... It really does go up, down, up. It's probably Minato... <laughs> don't put the order. Don't do the order because you're going to blow me. It might be Monato. What? How is Monato how is Monato the least likely? How? I don't I don't I don't know. I don't get it. I don't get that one. I don't say Monato. Yeah, he did last. play a lot of role for Sasuke, but Monato played role for yeah, most Yeah, Monato could have been like they yeah, that's what I'm saying. They hold him anyway. That's what I'm saying. Like they yeah, literally could have like, just let so Obito be the last nigga. Yeah. They, they could have made a whole nother story and said Obito would just hold like from the rock. Like another nigga could have did the same shit. Like, oh, I but Obito would have had to get saved by somebody else. Oh, nah, that's kind of not. But then no, no, then that would damn near be perfect because then the show would damn near just end at the war, the pain arc. Oh no. No, yeah, get me, get Mater out of here. Now get Mater out of here, bro. Not story-wise, y'all. Like we're just saying, like if they just went a whole different route before yeah, niggas just start not, talking. The story that the Naruto that we know today, based on the storyline, if that character didn't play that role, basically, which one? That one's confusing. Yeah, Mater had yeah, to go then. It was based off that. Yeah. All right, so pick one to survive. Mater was the easiest. An elephant, a hippo, a bear, or a gorilla. Okay, who will we survive against? 
This one might seem hard, but just look at it. Just look at it. I'm just look at it like this. I see three animals with their mouths wide open. Now you might think hippo, but hippos, that's the least option. I'm not I'm not surviving a hippo. You're not surviving against any of these if these trying to kill you. I'm gonna be honest with you. But if you want to say the least likely option, hippo. Get them out of here. Number two. Number two probably would have to be. Number two, tough. I, I, number two, I would say two and three is real close. The gorilla and the bear, those are close. Because gorillas, bro, they're strong as shit, bro. Like, yeah, they don't got the claws of a, 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 a grizzly bear or something, or a bear. We don't know if that's a grizzly bear or a bear. We could just say that's a bear. <laughs> so we just go say that's a bear. So, so I would definitely say gorillas, too. Three would be bear. Um, I feel like you're you're more likely to survive against a bear than a gorilla and a hippo. And then four would be an elephant. Elephants really can only run straight. You run at an angle on an elephant, you're straight. Now, if it's a stampede of elephants, okay, nigga. Like, at that point, you're cheating, nigga. Like, it's literally a picture of one elephant. If you're going against a stampede of all these niggas, an elephant will definitely be the least likely motherfucker to be survived against. But if we're talking about one-on-one, -on -one, elephant will be the easiest to survive against. Would you survive? No. Would you survive against a hippo? No. Would you survive against a grizzly bear? No. Would you survive against a damn gorilla? No. But the most likely would be an elephant. It's facts. It's facts. Just look at it. Just like, come on, bro. Just look at it. Oh, okay. What is a bomb again? <laughs> Why are you riding so quick? There's no way you know which one you're going to fight that fast. Say the, wait. I got my two. Wait, what? There, there can only be one, bro. Go ahead. I got my argument, too. It's a bomb again? Wait, 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 wait. Say him again. Elephant, a hippo, a bear, or a gorilla. <laughs> Are, are all of these good? Okay, oh, yeah, this one, is bro. this is survive against, not yeah, survive. kill. Survive against. Yeah, survive. So, Don't get killed by it. Like best not kill it. Against. Yeah, you just gotta live. Go. All right. Y'all oh. niggas picked a hippo? Yes. A gorilla? A gorilla? Yes. Yes. That was bloodless. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Hold, on. Yeah. Hold, on. Hold, on. hold on, hold on. I thought, bro, yes. bear. Yes. Those bears oh. bear can move fast. Hold on, hold on. Hippos, hold on. Yeah. Gorilla, yeah. gorilla. Yeah. Yes. Hippos like, kill hippo, for fun. Hippo, 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 you can probably run on the side of a hippo, bro. Fuck that one. No, you can't. If it's bloodlust, it's out. If a bear is gonna do this worse. No, no, no. If a hippo bites you once, you're out. Yeah, I know. If, if, you. if that bear, if, if that bear gets you, if that bear gets you, you're out. Hey, I think, I think, I think, I think it's faster away from a hippo. I seen a nigga on Avatar dodge that hole. Why that nigga on Avatar? I wasn't going to say nothing, but there's a lot of ignorance going on in this video. There's a lot. The fact that only one person chose a damn elephant is insane. Insane. I'm seeing niggas picking hippos. I'm seeing niggas picking hippos. Nigga, bro, you know how aggressive a fucking hippo is, nigga? Okay, the hippo, Do you, you might think it's cute, but nigga, just look up a video of a hippo. You, bro, out of all these animals, believe it or not, the fastest one is damn, is probably the hippo. That's one part of the hippo. Two, most aggressive, hippo. Three, the biggest, hippo. Uh, nah, that's cap. That's probably, the biggest probably elephant. I'm gonna be honest, the biggest probably elephant. Now, if you wanna say agile, that's probably the gorilla. If you want to say bite force, though, that's probably hit for again. So, no, bro. Like, no. no. no I don't got to kill you. No. You have no chance. No chance. You have no chance. You have no chance. First of all, wait, wait, like wait, 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 wait. He's smarter than them niggas, bro. He coming why did, through. Why did these niggas actually, why did, why did, why is it, why did these niggas actually all actually have different opinions? Like, why did they all actually choose all four options? This is not that close, bro. This is actually not that close, bro. Like, honestly. It's literally not. Now, gorilla and bear are, are close. But, like, the difference between hippo and the rest, not that close. The difference between elephant and the rest, not that close. I'm going to be honest. This is my argument. First of all, nobody has chances. That's a fact. Nobody has chances. We know that. But this nigga got But bear has no best chance. I think bear has no What the fuck you going to do with a bear, bro? You, bro, you try to throw hands with a bear. You're, you're, you're whole, you're ripped apart. You're ripped apart. 
Like, what are you talking about, bro? Bears are significantly bigger than you. They're, they're faster than you. What are you doing against a bear, nigga? They're biting you. They're clawing you. Like, what are you doing, bro? Bears can stand on, they can literally stand on, like, their two legs. Like, what are you doing against a damn bear, bro? How how did you come to the conclusion, bear? I don't hear a word these niggas are saying. I don't. He's literally just screaming. Each other. I swear I, I didn't hear a word. All I heard was chill. Gorilla niggas. What? Whoa, that's crazy, nigga. Look at the nigga face. No, gorilla niggas is crazy. I'ma be honest. Gorilla niggas talk is crazy. I'ma be honest. Gorilla niggas. Nah, that's sick. Nah, that's actually sick. Now, I don't really, you, dealing, you laugh a little too hard at that one, bro. I'm going to be honest. Gorilla niggas? Nah, that's crazy, bro. I'm going to be honest. That's, that's kind of crazy, bro. The middle value over here. Yes, this that nigga blood Hold on, hold on. What? Gorilla niggas? That, that's it. That's just sounds kind of crazy. Yeah, we can. Hey, that gorilla niggas dying. Gorilla niggas? Gorilla niggas? Gorilla niggas? Gorilla niggas? Gorilla niggas? Gorilla niggas? What? Gorilla, gorilla niggas? That's, that's, that's what that kind of racist. Oh, that shit racist, bro. How this nigga gonna say that shit racist, bro, and be the nigga that said it? You said it! Nah, this nigga's crazy. That's kind of racist. I didn't know that nigga was talking about. All right, come on, y'all. Get to y'all conclusions. I guess. I don't know, but. Oh, you said that? You said gorilla niggas, y'all. Y'all be true. All right. <laughs> gorillas, we got sentimental value over here. We can be like... Yeah, be for real. Oh, what the fuck is he doing to no damn gorilla? You know how strong a damn gorilla is? Gorillas are literally the most agile. No, no, no. I'm going to be honest with you. You're not getting away from... If you're talking about which ones are you getting away from, the, the least likely to get away from out of all these is a gorilla. Out of all these, the least likely for you to get away from is a gorilla because it's faster than you. And is more agile than you. And if you're in a, like a jungle, it's doing all type of gymnastics ass shit on you. Like, bro, no, no, you're not getting away from a gorilla. Uh, bro. At least if you're in like a terrain with a hippo or an elephant or even a bear, like nigga, they're they're not catching you. You know what I'm saying? But like maybe even not even a bear, just hippos and uh elephants. But I'm gonna be honest, like that, yeah. You're in a tough situation. Slower. Slower. Yeah, I don't know where that came from. I think they, I think they, I think they look, look, look. in combat. I see them two girls. They must be moving. Cover his feet. Did this nigga just try to run like a gorilla? You guys roam your rental room like, I don't know. There's There's a, gorillas? Are we surviving? Are we trying to escape? What are we doing? We're trying to escape. We are trying to escape. Nigga, this, this, yeah, see, that's, you see, if it was escape, yeah. Yeah, hippo and elephant, yeah. But survive is a completely different thing. That means that means something completely different. I was a bear. Bears don't get close to like forty miles per hour. Bro, gorilla is not fucking hard. Who do you think they are? We can't pick up. We can't pick up forty miles per hour in a room, bro. But listen, I'm here on the ground. I'm saying, bro, I've seen niggas. I've seen niggas get away from bears. Who? My gorilla. Nah, the, hey, ain't seen niggas get away from nah, this nigga has to have like a, 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 a reason for picking uh, look, a bear. Bro. I don't Out of all these gorillas, I mean, the one that dog checked that bear. <laughs> he did check. Yeah, it. I knew he had that bear. We talking about though? You seen a dog check a gorilla? Never seen it. You seen a dog check a check a hippo? No, this bear. You seen a dog check a bear? You seen a dog? You seen a dog? Hey, this bear's bloodlusted. He's bloodlusted. He's trying to kill. But hippos are like the most dangerous. He's not trying to escape. Understand? But these are all bloodlusted animals. But y'all have to have the highest peak. Who? Hippos. Yeah, hippos definitely got the highest peak. If we're talking about bloodlusted, nigga, like bro, them bitches already. Them bitches are already like extremely aggressive, bro. Like what? Getting around the hippos, literally, they grab you. If they get to you, it's over. Yes, all four of these. That's yeah, yeah. All four of these. Oh, no, it's over for y'all. They go. No. Yeah, that's how you know you lost your you argument, bro. If you gotta say everything is killing you, then like, you, you lost. True. We know this. I think you just take him a bear. You, 
Okay. It's which one is easier to survive. You're not surviving. But which one would you survive against longest? It's just the mouth. You just gotta dodge the mouth. That's it. What? That's what? it. What? Okay. So you have to just dodge the mouth. Oh, that's it. Versus a bear going like this. Nah, one thing I ain't think of. One thing I ain't think of with the elephant. I will be honest. Them motherfuckers do got a long ass trunk. That joint a little flexible too. I ain't think about that. I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna be honest. I didn't think about that. And apparently they can blow air out of them bitches really strong too. I ain't think about that. I will. I will say that. So they may not be agile, but they niggas do got a long trunk. Trunk. Like this. No, 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 it's, yeah, it's I'll probably you say, actually, gorillas and hippos are probably kind of closer because when it comes to trying to get away from a gorilla and compare it to a hippo, that's kind of wild. I'm gonna be honest. That's kind of wild. Gorillas might be up there with hippos. Let's do this. Let's do this. Gorilla, y'all are out. Y'all are out. Nah, hippos definitely out. I don't know. One, two, three, four. Cannot beat a gorilla, it's over. I mean, you cannot survive. No. That's the hardest. So the hippos, How the fuck are you getting get away from the damn hippos? Hippos, hippos, hippos are faster. Oh, they are fastest. They're the most aggressive. They kill the easiest. Like, I don't know what the argument is here. No, and running straight, no, running yeah. straight. Elephants are, are, are I'm pretty sure they're faster than gorillas. They're running in a straight 40, yes, but not like, yeah, if yeah, we yeah, get them away from them. <laughs> elephant, <laughs> elephant dead ass. Dang, boy. Bro, you're not, you're not, you're not mixing up no fucking gorilla on the planet. Right, I, can't, I can't do this. <laughs> I can't do this, y'all. You can't do this, you're not mixing up no fucking gorilla. You are elephant. Hippo definitely no. is, bro. Okay, it's okay. actually kind of tough between hippo and gorilla. Now that I'm thinking about it, because nigga, it's really no, tough. No, bro, them gorillas, them niggas no, swinging no, on no, shit. Them niggas, them niggas, like, no. Bro, like, no. They kill the most people, no, bro. bro. They can get, if a hippo gets you, you're probably gonna them die. Them motherfuckers probably the smartest, too. Like, nah, bro. Yeah, they kill the most, because the niggas play with their name. That's a fucking, all right? I understand that. Okay. But the thing about the hippo is, I don't know how quickly hippos can turn around quickly compared to the other three. Well, let's look at Gorilla, it up. you can't go all the time with right. Gorilla. Gorilla's gonna be like, bitch. You yeah, just yeah, said, fat, a yeah. bear, fat, same, yeah, huh? That's what, yeah. same thing. Well, I don't know. John, Elephants, yes, I, I don't know. You I just said it. They were playing with their names, right? right? They were playing with their names. All right, so we got our phones out. We looking up some shit. Yeah, okay, so after seeing, after seeing that uh, display for the hippo, what you say? <laughs> yeah, you're not beating a hippo. We can't get away from hippo. Yeah, you're not beating. Per hour. Human, <laughs> it says <laughs> the fast human so, Usain Bolt can't. You're not so, beating so you a damn hippo. That's more dangerous than per se. No, it still doesn't. No, our point, no, the point of our argument so. wasn't that we can get away in from one on one. Gorillas the dangerous. Yeah, <laughs> gorillas is just too in a room, bro. In a one on one, I don't know. I'm not mad at gorillas. Bro, pansies can whoop your ass one on one. I said that was too. They got that Diddy combo. Yes. Oh, we finalized the order. We finalized the order. Finalized. Hippo is in fact the most dangerous one. Yes. Hippo. You're dying. To <laughs> Look at it. Gorilla. <laughs> All right. Bear Bro. The what did I say? What did I say? What did I say? Hippo one, gorilla two, bear three, elephant four. If you want to, if you, you're surviving the easiest against what? Elephant. Bro, like I'm trying to tell y'all, but I really know what I be talking about. It don't matter what it is, movies, music. I know what I be talking about. It's facts, facts, facts. Okay, yeah. okay cool. cool. I guess. I guess. All right, don't do this. Okay, okay, okay. 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 You gotta okay. stop. You gotta stop. I'm good. All right, y'all. So we did a lot. But yeah, of that's pretty much gonna be the end of that video. Huh, man. That's 
Hey, it just, it, sometimes it just feels so good to be right. You know what I'm saying? And I feel I feel real good right now. But yeah, that's gonna probably be the end of this video. If you guys want more, like the video, subscribe, comment down below, help the algorithm, all that good stuff out the way. Without further ado, man, it's your boy Fitz. Yeah, man.